Have you ever been working on a graphic and in Photoshop, it looks great, but when you go to export it, everything just looks different. Well, this happens particularly often with graphics that use heavy noise. And the answer lies in the way that Photoshop previews your canvas. Typically, when you're viewing your whole canvas or your whole design, your zoom level in Photoshop is below 100%. That means that all the pixels on your canvas just cannot fit into the pixel resolution of your monitor, unless you have some sort of freakishly large monitor. So Photoshop has to render a compressed preview of all the layers in your canvas. To do that, it pretty much grids up your whole canvas and then it averages those pixels and blends them together to make the preview. Now, when your zoom is at 100%, that means that the pixel ratio from your canvas to your physical display is one to one. So zooming in shows you what your true canvas looks like, but it doesn't necessarily fix the issue. So if you want to fix that issue, you just have to use a less fine noise. So say if you're using the noise on a gray layer technique, then all I have to do is go up to filter and blur this noise by a little bit. As you can see, even just at a one pixel blur here, we're averaging out that noise quite a bit. So let's say I turn this to 0.4 or something. Now we're averaging that noise out sort of to where it gets us to that look that we had in the preview when we're zoomed out. This is what it looks like with that blur applied. And this is what it looks like without that blur applied. So if you're thresholding anything and this issue is happening where it looks different upon export or just looks different when you zoom in, all you have to do is blur it. Just blur it a little bit.